And as she likes it, she likes to lay down for it. I put a little bit of water mostly on the first brush I used. That was the main reason I was like, I might as well get you a little bit wet since it's hot out. And take up some of your hair. And then also, so give her a bath. It's hot out, so it shouldn't be too bad. But I kind of also don't want to get completely wet, but I don't know. <laughs> I'll leave about your bath. She doesn't always like her bath either, so. She's good about it, but. She's still not quite used to it. It's gonna be like, usually like a big chunk that comes out of there. <laughs> so I'm gonna go over. I'm gonna clean that one. But it's also kind of nice because as you brush it, it all like comes out for you. The other one's like just sticks in. It's easier to pull out. But yeah. Let's switch to this one. You watch in the cars. On the porch. I had to help my sister for a minute. Bring stuff in. My puppy. There we go. Hi. I really want to show the brush in her. Most of the time in the grass, she likes to roll over <laughs> and everything. But I was like, not great because my hair and your hair is all over the ground now. Because so. <laughs> I got my hair last night. So. Yeah. It's all messy because I didn't really brush it. But a lot less of it going on. It was like permanent bedhead even when I washed it. So it was a bit of a mess. Yeah, not that much is coming out. Well, I mean, a little bit is coming out, but you can't really see because it all just blows away. It's a little bit like that, so as you brush it, it just moves out. Let's focus on the tail. I think most of the hair is usually on the butt and everything, so since I can't really get to it as much, I can't really scratch it either. So I'll go a little harder. You just readjust it. <laughs> you want me to do your belly next? That's what she kept doing. So she'd like completely roll over. But I'm like, right now I'm rolling your back. Oh, no oh, crap. She wants to like eat it sometimes, or at least she did like once. She put a little bit in her mouth, and I was like, nope, that doesn't go in there. I mostly been just doing her back, but I did a little bit on her belly and everything, especially since she rolled over, and that was basically the only thing I could cover. <laughs> but I mostly just did it on her front and go really over her belly or anything, just a little bit over her belly. I went a little bit over with this one, so I was also a little more careful and didn't want to go down all the way. I don't know how sensitive it shouldn't be that sensitive since it's been a while. Since we got her and everything. She she failed out a little bit and then she also grew taller. She's taller than we got her. And she's taller than before. And then yeah, because she she just she was real skinny too. She was she was just a little bit on the skinny side, it wasn't too bad, I don't think so anyway. And then uh, she just slowly started gaining weight, and then she looked like she was a tiny bit overweight, and then she ended up growing a little bit taller, so it all evened out. <laughs> and I was like, her gaining a little extra weight is, isn't going to help anything. It's a good thing since she's, she was a little skinny before. But now, now she's good. Now it's still got a good stomach. Hi, Missy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's usually like right here where it's thicker. It seems to want to lick my toes sometimes. <sighs> I do not need you licking my toes. <laughs> this is not that I've gotten it. 
these being real cute. <sighs> yeah. So mostly just like right here, just up to this point, but now the rest of her. Oh, I should I should go on here. Yeah, right about here. This leg on this leg. Oh, yeah. I probably can't reach the spots. Well they're not that thick. Well, except for from the back. <laughs> Put your leg down. <laughs> nope, nope, can't read it right. Okay. You just, you like what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, you really like that spot then. You wanted to try and bite at it. Must be really itchy right there. Right in there. Sorry, the camera angle wasn't quite there on her, yes. She's moving all around too, doesn't help. Let's <laughs> look out. There's some kid toys out in the yard. Right now. I didn't really see her much before because I was working like crazy. So, whenever I did see her, I was like, oh, there's a change. <laughs> I look a little bit different. So, I didn't really notice in between. So, I was like, you're skinny. <laughs> On the next day, see you, you're fat. <laughs> but I had seen her a few other times. But I was just like, hi. And I was like, oh, duck. <laughs> what about seeing her? Anything else? a good shot of your face. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't know what's happening. <laughs> I keep just following you with a brush. I'm a crazy person, aren't I? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You're just a happy puppy. You don't really look happy, but you're a smile. It's also real nice today because there's a bit of a breeze. There was one earlier. A little bit, and that also helped earlier a little bit better, too. Because when she got up and everything... It just took all of the, and it also went the right way, but not the wrong way. <laughs> there might be a little bit on my screen. The hair just blows away as well, so that helps with this brush. There's really not that much on in here anyway. Oh, you, you're trying to scratch your back? <laughs> you said I didn't go get an OG job. Is that right? Is that right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you seem to be agreeing with me. Okay, I'll get, I'll try and get your back. <laughs> oh, that's where you pooped. I don't need to go into the territory of your poop. Maisie, come over here. She's really good and obedient. She really wanders off a little bit. But that only really happens if you leave her outside for more than a couple of minutes. And most of the time, if it's just like a couple minutes, then like maybe 10, then maybe 15, then she might just hang out on the porch or real close by on the grass. So, but if you leave her for quite a while, then she likes to run off. And part of it might have been because she hasn't like been outside for a while and then you were doing other stuff outside and probably went back inside, so. She's like, most of the time when she's by herself, she's like, I'll go find people. Or find other dogs and stuff. So, we sometimes have to put her in the cage as punishment. But she's getting better at also going in the cage and everything. Gotten used to it. And then, for a while, it was a real problem with her wandering all over the place just because we couldn't, she wouldn't stay outside. So then we switched to having her inside. Which made sense she was more of an indoor dog anyway, so she went she didn't want to stay outside and then there were too many holes in the fences and then she could dig her own and everything. She was a real smart puppy. Yeah, you are. 
Here we have some random again. Okay. I'll probably... It was, like, a lot thicker than this before. Which is good. I got the bulk of it out earlier, I guess. Okay. Let's focus on your rear. <laughs> I can't get it when you walk away. <laughs> something about that cheese only like a little bit over here or something. So it's still growing. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna hold back the camera a little bit more. So I think it's too zoomed in. Oh, I'm not zooming in. Maybe I did. I probably did at some point. Just don't remember when I zoomed it in. So just normally a little bit zoomed in. Okay, yeah. I kind of want to get that spot, you know. A lot of hair comes out of that one. But she likes to move a lot. Let's see if we can get it. <laughs> Sorry about that. I hit your leg and. Uh, Trying to get it real quick while you walked by. And you walked a little bit slower than I thought you would. Yeah. My knees for this dog. <laughs> Hi, puppy. Yeah. I'm trying to eat your hair. <laughs> There's nothing on it now. But I think when she wants to get her, they're not gonna be there. Okay, get some uh, chunks out of here. But yeah, this is definitely recommend. My sister, Bobbins. It's real nice. Nice brush. It's also real nice that she doesn't have real thick hair. Because we were thinking that she's a, a Labrador and Golden Retriever mix. She's clearly more on the lab side because she has very thin hair. Uh, I saw a few images, so she probably is. Because I guess, I'm pretty sure before we thought she was just like a Golden Retriever. But she is way too thin of hair for that. <laughs> They have a lot of thick coats. She is one decent coat. One pretty decent coat. It seems a lot thicker because I'm brushing it. <laughs> it's a lot thicker than I thought it was anyway. It probably grows a little bit thicker. So it's like one and a half coat or something or a good thick coat in the winter. But she pretty much lost all of it. So I honestly just put her on the back and it's a lot thinner. Maybe because I've been brushing her. Yeah. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Give my head one way. Get the camera another. I'm pretty happy with this. Only a little bit of hair is coming out though. Oh, I should switch brushes. You want to follow me? I don't usually have so much time together. Hi, puppy. Not a few toys out to play with, but I've been brushing her hair, so she's been paying that much attention to them. This one's real small. But I did a good job. But yeah, you definitely want the bigger ones. I think this is just, honestly, for just, like, checking for lice or something. <laughs> yeah, but she's clean. She just had a little bit of dandruff before. 
I might just give her a good rinse. So I'm thinking, I don't know. Maybe. Want to look at the camera? <laughs> Ignore me. Okay, there we go.